Maxwell and Lucky Owl. Uh, honestly, I got to go with my boy Stax. Here's the All right, Stax is bringing a mage, a druid, and a warlock. And then Lucky Owl, we got Priest, Pally, and Warlock. <laughs> honestly, yeah. the only reason I'm going to give it to Stax <laughs> is because his mage is Freeze Mage. And none of the, like, he will get a win versus any of these decks. Actually, Warlock can go off, but. <coughs> Surprised to see Priest. I think Lucky Owl uh, might might be incorrect, but I think Lucky Owl is the only Priest player right now. Yep. I was going to bring one, but then I realized how <coughs> bad I suck with it. <laughs> Lucky Owl with the pretty terrible hand. No way. Wait, did she did she mulligan for that? Didn't no, even what happened? It. Didn't look like she threw any cards away. That's pretty bad. Huh? Got into the void oh, color already, shit. so. She's playing against Handlog. You know what? Cool thing is she knows now to respect the Moltens. She knows. <laughs> oh god, her hand's so bad. <clears throat> well, at least she's tapping. I mean, if she, if she has the chance, she could set up a really good Here Void Terror play. Definitely a Drake. Yeah, yeah she can. She have a really sick Void Terror, actually. But she's probably just going to go Void Color Face. There she goes. <coughs> I mean, what are you supposed to do? And I guess next turn, she has a good uh, Power Overwhelming. Kill that thing. Spawn the... Uh... Ooh, just a little bit out of range now. That's not good. Mm -hmm. I don't, honestly, I. That's tough. I, 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 I no might, just, I, pro, I might just say play the, maybe just play the void caller. Yep, I would definitely, I would definitely. Ooh, I don't know. If, she's probably gonna hit it and. It's lucky I was a uh, little inexperienced coming, but she's good at the game. Ooh. I'd laugh so hard if he has nothing to kill it. That yeah. is literally the worst one. <coughs> that is yeah. the number one worst one that could pop out. Look at look at that head shake. She's not very happy about this. So when when your whole hand is demons, that's just a really big gamble. Yeah, yeah. Because it was uh, about half of her hand was she's bad to hit. Pretty fucking bad. Sorry, my <laughs> language. Ah, oh, pretty bad. Because sometimes it's probably pretty bad though. She's not in a horrible position. Now at these least. guys are like, I knew we shouldn't have let him commentate. Yeah. Statue gets the double recycle with Mortal Coil. Perfect clear. Any games cards. It's not looking good. <laughs> I would definitely say Void Caller tap. Yeah. But it's that inexperience coming in. Look, for as much as she doesn't play, she's really good at this. Yeah, hey, hey, Lucky Owl's still in winner. Or yeah. no, this is losers now, isn't it? She's still in losers, yeah. Yeah, this losers. is losers, but. Yeah. She's definitely the best girl that I've seen play so far. That she is. Oof. A little BM action. There we go. I hope she doesn't trade. Oh, she probably will trade. That's okay. Uh oh. Incoming shadow flame. Oh, he he burned. Oh, that's why he said it was a mistake. I see. I didn't even see that. She did forget to tap though. She did. She did. I know. Yeah. I don't know why she didn't tap actually. Is he a shadow flame on the 8-5? Oh my god. Is that game? That's probably game. Oh wow. Yeah. She the iron bee. Could I just she should tap first. Unless she's uh discarding now gains. That was actually that was really good. Yeah, that was. I hope she there you go. Oh trade. There you go. She got it. That would be... No! 
she oh, set wow. herself up for a really big shadow flame yep. play. Yeah, for sure. Definitely should have attacked face. You attack face because, uh... Wait, Claude, Claude, I don't think there's any more uh, girls in this, is there? Are there any more tournament girls? No. Yeah, she should have went. She should have went face though. That way, the shadow flame, make him trade. I don't really. <laughs> do you, how do you feel about handlock on ladder? On ladder? Yeah. Uh, I mean, it is. It's pretty strong versus a lot of the top decks right now. It's got a good matchup against Patron. Yeah, it does. It's obviously the the best deck right now. I tried running it. I kept running into Hybrid Hunter, <laughs> not Face. So, but uh, absolutely zero autism. It's definitely one of my favorite decks. Yeah, definitely. So yeah, it's a pretty good deck. I just get wrecked with it. <laughs> What's up, that sick kid? Thanks for the support. Sadly, I'm out. Dex is going to trade. Trades. I guess he can trade. There's no reason for him not to. Maybe he's going to okay, not taunt us. I don't know. if I definitely wouldn't have. Nah, maybe, actually. He's afraid of a uh, power overwhelming Doomguard, which Ooh. is a good thing to be afraid of. Bain Come on, Doom. RNG. And the worst. She's going <laughs> to shake her head. I know she's pissed right now. <clears throat> I'd be pretty mad, too. I think Staxwell's got this one. It's looking bad. Huh? This, this might be actually uh, a 3-0 because if she goes with Warlock the whole time. Oh, yeah. Um, I was going to say she she could still uh, get like a power overwhelming, like a Beast of Surgeon type yeah. thing, but I think that heal bot just. But no, yeah, Freeze Mage <laughs> is definitely going to most likely beat uh, Zulok. Or demons funny, you. Funny thing is, is there 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 was the abuse of surgeon. Yep, there it was. <laughs> <laughs> That's all she needed. Oof, and a rag. rag Here gross. comes this the. Is, uh, oh my God! Yep, and you just go face. Got a 50-50 win. Rag always yeah, goes face. When does Rag not go face? Right. Six yeah. minions, Rex still goes face. Right, so Staxwell is 1-0 uh, right now. It's not looking good for this next one because Freeze Mage versus Demon Zoo is... I mean, Demon Zoo's got to have some good void calls to even come close. Who's hating? Don't worry about it. Oh, okay. <laughs> Never mind, I don't, I don't worry about that. All right, you're off. <laughs> All right. We're bringing in the pro commentator now. I know he's cheating. He's in here trying to gain advantage on Dex. Look at him. Look at him standing there. Oh. I mean, Gibbonation did commentate the first set, but got that edge though. Yeah. That's why he three would his opponent. Why? Because <laughs> he had all that insider info. Yep. Yeah. Yep. So we've got Lucky Owl versus Stax. Well, it looks like Stax took the first match. How was that? Stax did uh, good. Lucky Owl had some misplays. Minor, but enough to uh, enough to put her back really far. Oh, really? Yeah. She had some really bad RNG on her side, too. She had a hand full of demons with Void Color, and the worst one popped out. You know her tractors only give her female demon pilots? Say what? Her uh, tractors? Yeah, her, her the, the four drop. Oh yeah, only uh, Mistress of Pain and uh, only Mistress of Pain and uh, the succubus. succubus. Yep, she cannot get anything else from I've, Void Color. I noticed because uh, that's that's what happened. Yeah, uh, la her last set I watched. She's oh, like, you're talking about her Bane of Dooms. No, uh, no, no. I mean her, her tractors. Tractors. Her her pilot. Her piloted gold. Oh, piloted shredder. Yeah, her pilot. Talking about? Yeah, yeah. Her, her oh, piloted yeah, yeah. shredders, yeah. man. Yeah. They only gave her the demons. That's, uh, I mean, come on. Hearthstone knows. It knows, it knows. that a grill's playing she's, and that she's got she's 
Yeah. <laughs> it's not looking too good right now for her. He's going to get two cards right now. Yeah. Why do I have this eight? This is uh, just a terrible matchup for Zula. Unless she gets some sick Void Call. She needs Malganus to win. That's number one. She has to get Malganus. She could get a really nice Bane of Doom. Yeah. She's got to get Malganus out. If she gets Malganus out, he has to waste Burn on it. And usually it, uh, it wastes a whole turn, which is really, really, really bad for uh, Mage. Let's Come see, what, on, did we, what did we get here? Uh, That's a really, really good Bane of Doom. Dread Infernal. That's insanely good. Definitely good. I would take it. I'll take that every day. Yeah. If, if Bane of Doom was just summon a Dread Infernal. Yeah. Deal two damage. If it kills it, summon Dread Infernal. That would be amazing. That would be the best card in the game. <laughs> that would be a I'd, really I'd good card. I'd run four in my deck. <laughs> I'd put in a Lore Walker Cho just so I can get more back. It would almost have to cost six mana. Yeah. The funny thing is it would be doing the one, one extra damage than a normal Dread Infernal. Yeah. <laughs> but only to one creature, which it is. The end is coming, is it? I don't think that's a very good... Uh... Yep, all right. That's a better... Now nah, they're just going to be frozen for a little bit. Yeah. Oh, my God. There it is. Now you throw out that Void Color. Mm-hmm. Oh, tap first, of course, but... Maybe you don't tap. Do you want another demon in your hand? I don't think you do. Yeah, you tap, though. What are the chances? I don't want another demon in my hand. Not when I have that. Yeah, that's pretty amazing. Because next turn is Dr. Boom Malkanis. Yeah. Uh, maybe. She needs a silence, though, actually. Because well, he definitely has the uh, Doomsayer in hand. I don't see Staxwell playing anything that oh. could kill the Void Callers other Wait. than... Oh, that really is bad for him, actually. Ooh. That's really bad for him. So... And just end turn or tap, I guess. I would tap. I mean, she can't really kill the Doomsayer. I hope she does. She doesn't have a lot of experience playing against Freeze Mage, so I'm not sure what she's going to do, but she has to realize that only one imp can come out. It's impossible to kill the uh, Doomsayer. And I think she's just going to tap and pass. Come on, you know what to do. Yeah, there's really no there reason to do anything else. That's a really good pass. She played it right. Here he comes. Hella spiders and a demon lord. There is Malganus. Did you know he's eternal? Yeah. He is Malganus, and he is a eternal. So Staxwell... Ooh, forced to play the emperor. This is going to be a... This is going to be some pain right here. Yeah, he's that def is... Uh, so that thing's yeah, getting implosioned for sure. I, I might actually just power overwhelm it. I don't think I would implode it. I would just power over moment and keep it. I mean, this is, this is a YOLO play, man. It's a Ooh. very YOLO play. But see, if you... Uh, same thing. I, oh, my God. And this then is a free just, card. Never did I think... Uh, I never thought this would come down to this. But that Malganus... I mean, Dennis, once that pops up, it doesn't look good. Staxwell has to get rid of that Malgana somehow, and it's going to probably it, be with burn. a fireball. Yeah, it has to be fireball. He could, uh, to cycle, he could put out Blood Mage and uh, fireball it and ping something else. Yeah, Blood Mage could definitely do the trick right His now. His best move right now, though, if he had another Frost Nova, which he doesn't, does he? He used both of them. Oh, yeah. Yeah, if he had Frost Nova, he could just... There'd be zero damage. I mean, he can't even Blizzard in. and freeze the Malganus no, right now. <laughs> well, he could. He well, could I guess blizzard, he could. If he, then, he did have the Emperor, so yeah, if the right yeah. cards were hit, then he could What have needs been to come fine. out is uh, Dr. Boom right now. Dr. Boom needs to come out. Oh, wait a minute. Only one Boombot, though. So, yeah, she's got to pop that. Can she pop it? Yeah. Yeah, she can pop it. It's fine. She's got to pop it. I, I don't know if she has enough. Does she? Eight, seven, eight... If she plays the defender. I think she does. Yeah. 2, 4, 9, 10, 11, 12. That's perfect. That's yep. exact. Uh, no, do the imps last. No, she did it wrong. <laughs> doesn't matter. Oh, she doesn't. Yeah, power overwhelming? Yeah, oh, no, no, it doesn't shit. matter. No, she should have popped it. You got to pop it, you know? Power overwhelming would have popped it. Now yeah. she's uh, severely behind. Yeah, we know, chat. Not everyone's a uh, a pro. Dude, but but look at it this way. What's up? 
she could play Dr. Boom and not pop it. And then he can't wipe her board or use Blizzard or Flame yeah, Strike or anything. Yeah, the thing is, that was a turn to pop it because now he could waste burn on her face and end the game next turn. If he has the burn, she loses, right? So he already used a fireball, and now he's going to get more fireballs. So it's pretty much game over. He's going to get a fireball now, and I think he's going to Frostbolt Iceland's face to get two of them, actually. So it will be game. Oh, look at that. Never mind. But he could have drawn a fireball. Uh, did she run so any what? form of healing? All right. Oh, she's she's not leaving it at one. The plays. So she's got to power overwhelm and kill that. She has to. Or not. Do, yeah, yeah, I guess it doesn't have to be power overwhelm. Yeah, it doesn't really matter. Now she just passes. You don't tap. You don't do anything. You just pass. Dr. Boom actually would be the play. Yeah, Dr. Boom is a good play Dr. because then he can't play. wipe the board. I hope she didn't hit. Oh, come on. <laughs> Oh, what is she doing? She's killing me. She had this. Well, she does not have any experience playing Freeze Mage, though, so not a lot she can do. He's going to fire. What's up? Technically, if he had Flame Strike right here, then it would still leave her open. Oh, my God. Wait. Yep, an Ice Lance. So he had it anyways. Yeah. She didn't tap, right? No. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, she, she didn't. It didn't matter. The thing is, though, she... You know what? She would have actually had she popped the uh, block. Oh, with, with the, the power overwhelming. The, with the power overwhelming two yeah. turns prior. If she popped the block with the power overwhelming, that would have been game for her. Popped the what? The ice block. No, she popped it too late. Even that turn, if she did not no, the second play. The two yeah. turns ago, she didn't block it. If had she know, popped the block. Oh my God! Yeah, that was game. Dr. Boom power overwhelming a bot. That would have been game over. Oh, does... Oh, wait. No, 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 no. The turn... He's still immune. Yeah, no, he'd still be immune. Yeah, yeah. You're immune until it's your turn. That's how it works. All right, well, this game should be a win for her. This should be a win, but... When Druid gets a really lucky, oh my gosh, look at that shade. Yep, that's what happened to me when I played. <laughs> hmm. I got Innervate shaded on. But it's still it's still a very uh, still a very lopsided matchup. Warlock, even with that, oh, maybe not. This is uh, the dream start. It really this is, is the dream start for Druid. That oh, okay, that helps a lot actually, a lot, a lot. Wow. So now we've got a 4-4 and a the top decks are real. Got a lot of damage coming out turn yeah. 4, especially with that implosion. That's it. Yep. <laughs> we got my back. Let's see. What do we have? Uh, I, have I no was thinking of Shredder gonna, maybe, but no, I he's guess gonna not. Wrath that, but Yeah. I mean, it's greedy, but it's it's good. It works out for a uh, next play. He's gonna kill the. Uh, hmm. He's gonna kill the void terror. He has a knife juggler. Yeah. That he can play. Do you play it or do you just uh, go on curve with the uh, three and the one? Probably just the three and the one. Yeah, I think I do the three and the one too. Let's see. She's looking at implosion, but she can't hit anything. It's shaded. So yeah. I'm guessing if she's going to do it, she's, I mean, there's only two plays. You tap and play knife juggler, or you imp gang boss and abusive sergeant. Yeah. I think, though, she's planning for next turn. And I think she's going to be greedy with the knife juggler and save it for turn six with the implosion. It's not bad. It's just not very proactive. The imp boss, I feel, was probably a little bit stronger there than a life tap, but... Yeah, I, I would agree. She's uh, getting a little greedy with the knife juggler. All right, well, she can kill that, which is a good thing. If Implosion doesn't give her a two, which, I don't know, with her luck, it might be how it's going today. 50 Actually, chance. you might leave it alive, though, right? He only has three cards in hand. Maybe. Do you have to kill it? Can you wait one turn? Oh, she's going to go for it. Barely well, enough. She got her three. I don't know if I can 
if I kill it there, I think I might develop more board. Yep. Yeah, because he was just going to play support Now card would anyway. be the, um, the knife juggler implosion play, which would be perfect. I think you just kill off the shade before, but... Come on, Staxwell. What are you thinking about? Playing an innervate and a I'm just hero with. power. Yeah. Staxwell is a really good player. He does have an innervate he's, in he's hand. Play, he's played solid all day. I think she's going to knife juggler defender. Most likely, hopefully, one will hit the shade. Please hit the shade. Oh. Force well. is not with her. So Staxwell is looking to probably... He's just going to set up for combo turn 9. Yeah, develop as much of a board as possible and then combo. The good old combo. 9 mana, 14 guaranteed. Kind of insane. Just got to play that this Dr. Is, uh, Balanced. Oof, it's not looking good. This might be game coming up because he only used one innervate if he has it in his hand. Even double Savage Roars game. Let's see. One oh, damage no, it's not. Wait, there on we go. a bomb. Come on. Hit the other bomb. Do it. Uh, all right. Well, it's not game yet. I, I think I would hit it. Just just from combo, yeah. I don't think that was bad. All right. RNG. <laughs> there you go. Yeah. Took four damage there. Yeah. It's pretty good. Stacks well will more than like oh yeah he's still not quite at combo well unless one of his pieces were hit by Tharson but there weren't a whole lot of cards in his hand when he used that. Ooh, double swipe, double swipe or wrath? He already used one. Oh, okay, that's both wraths. Wait, did he use a wrath? He did. Yeah, right? he did. He used a wrath. At the beginning of that's the game. Both wraths. <laughs> I love it. You try. <laughs> Sorry. Twitch chat is my favorite pastime. <laughs> oh, she had one more mana. Oh, she had one more mana. She might just have to uh, discard some cards. Yeah, I might do that, actually. All right, well, got rid of... Yep. Uh, it could be worse. Could have been Malganus and Sylvanas. This isn't looking good, though. This mm. looks like it might be a 3-0. Let's see, stacks well. Lothar. Lothar comes out. Props Benning. to uh, Lucky Owl for making it this far, though. Yeah. Hey, it's not over yet. I mean, now it's, I don't want to say it's over, but it's pretty over, man. It's, she knows it. She, she knows she got, uh, she got scooted. She got pooter scoot. Oh, wait. Ooh. She's going to heal maybe, a little bit. Maybe, if no combo, maybe. Yeah, GG. We're gonna have, we're gonna see our uh, force of nature drew to the claw for the win here. Son of Flynn, you're kind of getting creepy, man. I never call it Twitch chat, but I'm creeped out. Oh, keep it the grove. There it is. There you go. I'm just kidding, man. I hope you guys are enjoying this stream brought to you by GameWorks. 